So Doodle Cart is another great application by J2Site, the application developer. And um, there is a light version of this application for free in the App Store, but the full version is a dollar. And I'd say it's definitely worth it. So at the main menu we have New Game, Continue, Statistics, Options, Open Faint, and More Games. You can change your name up there as well. So I'm going to click Continue. That's basically the results of my last race. And in the beginning of each race, it's going to show you the map of the uh, track. You get to choose your car color. And you'll be able to use these little um, coin things, or whatever you want to call them, to upgrade your car. So we have speed, acceleration, handling, weight, and items. So I'm going to bring up my speed, and it counts them down from there. We're going to bring up, bring up my acceleration. I'm going to bring up my handling. Bring up my weight. And uh, yeah, I think that's good. We can reset, back, and race. So I have it set to landscape mode, but you can change it to portrait. I'm going to show you a little bit of the gameplay. This is go, uh, stop, use item, and um, and uh, and it just crashed. And I'll choose from stage two. There are five state five stages from different worlds. We have this little uh, graph paper looking one. We have the Earth, the Sun, crayons, and a mysterious one. So I'll just show you stage one race and there are a bunch of uh, ra uh, race tracks for each stage so I'll basically just show you this one resume so we have the bunch of cars the countdown left and right use item and acceleration I'm holding not down on and above that is brake and you can drift it drifts automatically no need to use the brake I don't find the brake very useful. And as you can see in the top, it shows a picture of a pencil. And that's that just lets you know which item you're currently holding. So I can use it by clicking that, and that can shoot at your opponent. But you saw the little uh, thing I just ran over there. I'll try and get another one right there. That's what I just ran over. That's basically like the item block from Mario, but it's just a little symbol you run over. And you can leave different things like holes in the ground, like I just did right there, which lets your opponent fall. It's a really fun game. I definitely think it's worth a dollar. It gets it's very easy on this uh, racetrack right here, but it gets much harder with a bunch of different obstacles. So there are, I believe, 25 tracks total, five for each of the five stages. Um, so that's it. I'll see you guys later. I'm going to pick up the phone. Thanks for watching. Rate, comment, and subscribe. Peace.